Hello everyone, Jeremy here with another Funko Pop Vinyl figure and this is from their WWE line, World Wrestling Entertainment. And I had no idea that they even had a license to produce WWE Pop Vinyl figures, but they do. And through going through Toys R Us, I found one of a few. This is Hulk Hogan, the immortal, the iconic Hulk Hogan in pop vinyl action figure form. So, got this for about $9.99 there at Toys R Us. And it comes in like the usual type of packaging that we are used to with these pop vinyl figures by now. In which you can see most of them. Uh, most of the figure just by looking at the display from the front and to the sides. Now when we flip it on the back we can see the different figures we can get in this individual series from 7 to 12. So we've got Daniel Bryan, The Undertaker, Triple H, Macho Man, Randy Savage, Hulk Hogan, and AJ Lee. But there are more of these figures. I've seen some online. I've seen like Stone Cold Steve Austin, The Rock, Sheamus. I mean, there's there's all kinds of different WWE superstars that Funko has managed to make figures for. And I had no idea that those were even a thing. But now I do. And Hulk Hogan is perhaps one of the most, well, he is the most iconic wrestler of all time. Because no matter if you are a grandparent, a parent, someone my age, or maybe even a kid, you see this guy and you know, even if you don't know his name, you know who he is in some regard. With that being said, let's take a look at him outside of the package. This is just so good. Can I tell you how good this is? First of all, it's freaking Hulk Hogan, okay? It's Hulkamania, it's running wild, in pop vinyl figure form. They did such a good job with this. I mean, check out that mustache. The classic handlebar Hulk Hogan mustache. Those shades that he has. And, you know, even the do-rag. And his blonde hair that's always hanging under that do-rag. It's, it's just so good. They did a great job. The paint is near perfect. On this particular figure and man I and even check it out it even has like the little sideburns right there that is a nice touch they did not have to do that at all in those shades <laughs> those shades are really really good if I had to complain about anything from this Hulk Hogan figure is that the reds don't look quite as red as the red that Hulk Hogan wears and the yellow on his do-rag doesn't look as yellow as the do-rags that Hulk Hogan wears. It's almost as if it looks like they're not saturated enough. They just needed to have that red bumped up a little bit and this yellow bumped up a little bit. And it really would have just popped in that way. And I'm looking at his pants and even his pants look like they may be a little greenish for some reason, you know, but... He still looks like a really good figure. It still is a really good figure. Uh, those are just the little nitpicks that I have. You know, I just wish that it were, I uh, wish that the shades were more red, his boots were more red, and that the yellow was more yellow. Really make it pop. So just like all these other pop vinyl figures, there is no articulation. You can't take anything off. You can't take off the shades. You can't take off the do-rag. You can't pose him. You can't do anything. All you can do is sit there and admire this little, quite adorable, action figure, pop vinyl figure of Hulk Hogan. Now, unlike Deadpool that you can see in the background and Groot, this is not a bobblehead. So, he's just normal, just a normal pop vinyl figure. But you know what, guys? If you are a WWE fan, much like me, and you are a collector of fine collectibles, action figures, I mean, this is, this is something you really have to get. I decided that if I were going to get one from the from the few that I've seen, The Undertaker, Hulk Hogan, and Triple H there at Toys R Us, I said, hey man, I love The Undertaker, and Triple H would be cool to have, but I gotta get Hulk Hogan. It's just Hulk Hogan. Come on. So, my wrestling side is uh, coming out again, but 
Again, good job, great job, Funko, with these pop vinyl figures. I have yet to see one that I did not like. And me being a wrestling fan, this just brings it full circle, and it gets a thumbs up from me. And Hulkamania, printed very nicely on that do-rag. Good attention to detail. I dig it. I dig it, brother. So, thanks so much for watching. Until next time, I'm Jeremy, and I'll talk to you later.